I started at BTTG in Didsbury and uh, that was 20 years ago now. I had a feeling in my first few months I'd be here for a long time. I joined the company in, uh, in 1982. I started at Shirley Institute in 1968. The history is amazing at this place. A lot of the equipment that's been developed throughout the textile industry started here. When I first started it was more like a, a university or, or on those lines and it was very, very formal. We were actually getting money from the government to do research that was part sponsored by industry. The business has gone through difficult times. It was difficult, first of all, this transition from relying on government funding uh, through to being a commercial organisation. The company uh, had to become a lot more commercially minded and we looked at other areas to diversify into. Uh, the next big area to, to come along was uh, fire testing. I've been with the organisation for over a quarter of its life now and to see how it's, it's changed and developed and to know that it, it's still here is, 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 is wonderful. There has been a total change. It doesn't surprise me now that we've that we reached the 100 years. I like the fact that people love their jobs and they care about the jobs and they care about getting it right and they want to get it right for customers. Every day is different, literally every day is different. I find my day-to-day -day variety is, is, is superb in this job. When I first started here, uh, one of the first carpets that we got into test was from the Titanic Society um, and they asked us to set, identify whether the carpet was actually on their Titanic. That could give an indication of the type of construction that was around in that, those times. I've done a lot of TV work where we are doing practical laboratory testing as the basis of um, consumer inquiry programmes, such as Tonight, um, Watchdog. I seem to have become the, the face of consumer testing with the white lab coat and the pens in the pocket that uh, everybody associates with being a scientist. We have two mannequin systems in BTTG. The first one is Ralph, research aims, longer protection against heat, and we also have a female mannequin, Sophie. System objective protection against heat in an emergency. Some of the Grand Prix drivers that you see on Sundays are wearing clothing that we've actually tested and approved. It's quite enjoyable to see what you've produced in the world. It's always been a family-oriented company. Everyone gets on well together. We see each other socially. From my point of view, it's been a bit like a second home, really, because I, the work was so interesting and I enjoyed it so much. For me, Shirley is uh, like a family. I feel like uh, I come in the place and to go to work, I, I'm going home. The fact that we do retain staff is obviously a good feature. We have to make sure that our family of staff are obviously happy and I think that's what we, we strive to do. Obviously there are big challenges ahead, Brexit being one of the biggest ones at the moment, but I believe we can get past that. I see the company continuing to expand, uh, particularly on an international level. It is a group of exceptional people doing exceptional work to the best of their abilities. For me, Sirle is continuous improvement because it's, it's keep reinventing and growing. We're constantly expanding, constantly developing, constantly looking to keep clients happy. That's what we do. I think the company celebrating the 100 years is very good. I can't believe that they've been going that long. That obviously shows how good we are. There aren't many companies similar to ourselves who have been around anywhere near as long. And I think it's just a mark to the company that we have managed to last that long and keep going and evolve. It is just a milestone. I think we shouldn't look at it as a finishing post. We've survived 100 years, but it's what we do now, what we do for the future that's important. So we should, like they always train runners, run through the finishing line at full speed and carry on, carry on going. I'm getting to the end of my time here after 40 years, but I hope it continues to, to grow and to be uh, more successful than it is today. Over the last few years we've opened offices in numerous different countries and I just hope that the company continues to grow and prosper and I think if we carry on the way that we have maybe we'll even get to 200 eventually. If I had to sum up BTTG I'd say exceptional. Global. Integrity. Survivor. Progressive. Dynamic. Challenging. Diverse. One word to describe the company? 
Innovative. Adaptability. Expert. Friendly. Improvement. Family. Home. 